Well, hello, hope you're doing well today. And today we're in a massive place to explore. We have multiple garages, a huge um, oil factory, and everything uh, that this place has to offer. So let's go explore this together and hope you enjoy it as I do in this exploration. So let's go check everything that this has. What I noticed about this building was, I think, it used to be a storage area and where they did uh, like mixtures and stuff. So, like uh, this part, uh, a storage space. Like they put this is like tents, like uh, this one inside, or some other small things. And I saw that one as well with tiles. I don't know, don't know if that part was the same as well as this one. But it should be there. Okay, kept it clean as well. So like this one, just nice chickens and eggs. And let's check out the others. It's all the same. Like, there's a fan up there. It's moving because of the slight breeze we're having. But I think it's all same concept. Uh, storage of different kinds of things, I know. Um, and here I found, like, just to have an idea as well, like. Yeah, what they used to store. Like, so the tanks. I think they were like water tanks. Uh, and supplies for the house, I think. Let's check out. So, later we'll go to that buildings. But first, there's a factory over there. Check it out later. And here we have, I think, CO2, uh, fire extinguisher, like CO2 foam. It's just like compressed there. And obviously, like soap, detergents, and stuff like that. So let's go to this factory right here. What I can see is like paint. Oh, a generator. Let's go in. It's like a generator for the whole place. Oh, this one's much cleaner. It's like, I don't know what. Uh, this is the uh, maker of it. Hello, what's yeah, it's a, what's a, an English uh, maker? I compare its volts. This is like good old stuff here. Oh. <laughs> and let's here. What's it? Yeah. Here we are. Like water tanks. Maybe. Let's go check the inside of it. Just to see. So let's go in. Would you look at that? Would you look at that? There's still machinery here. And still, there is like oil here. I think these bottles were put here, going round like this part. And obviously, uh, this would press and fills the bottles. And I don't know where it, they go. Oh, I think they go back here. So obviously, oh, there's still plastic here. And they would finish. Right here. 
Oh, it's wind. I don't know this part of the machinery, but it was. I think it's the same part, but smaller. It's still like on and off switch. Need to see where the on and off buttons on this thing is. Where? Where is it? It's like obviously uh, where electricity is. Oh, they're here. This is nice. Let's go continue. I think this was the packaging area where, obviously, uh, where they finished from here. They were put here because there are huge pellets here, huge amounts of pellets. But I think that was uh, the bottles of it. Either that was small one for the uh, for the houses or like that for the restaurants and big places. So check this part out. I think this were like where uh, water pumps were like to wash your hands and stuff like that. Still like still smells of oil as well here. the fire extinguisher was I think this one as well the generator for this place let's go upstairs and check what's here as well as I said it still smells of olive oil as well which is still nice after these years of being abandoned look how big this place is so like locker rooms for the Factory, I think. Let's check out that room out. Huge three stories full of stairs. There are lots of papers here. I want them hat here. I think this was like the break room or the changing room here. So obviously, there is like to bathroom, shower area, obviously lockers all over the place. Let's check out. Oh, looks nice. Let's continue right there. Ooh, there's more machines there. Right, <laughs> hello. The first aid kit here, the dry powder. Just look at this amazing bit. So these huge tanks go to the other floor as well. Have to be careful because obviously it is rather slippery and sticky as well. Yeah, going back there. Obviously, like a wash hand base in there. These were like oil refinery. I think like uh, oil for the machines, not for the cooking oil. But obviously, it's simply amazing. Let's just go check the other floor. Check what there is as well. It's rather creepy. And on this floor, there is as well the first aid kit. And dry powder. It's empty. An old telephone there. Oil. and that's the other side of the factory yep. Ooh, this is cool thermometers 
and this is the other half of the uh, tanks we were just down there this part was uh, where they distributed like oil and generated the whole uh, line of work so what I noticed and saw uh, the things and the machineries um, the first floor was all of, uh, obviously olive oil like for cooking and then uh, if it's restaurants for example or hotels or big uh, industrial stuff uh, they used to bring it back here as used oil and then on the second and third floor it was converted into biodiesel which is pretty cool because uh, I turned like try to explore it more and they used to do it that I mentioned it's used oil and it was taken upstairs to be converted into grease and uh, used cooking oil to turn it into Biodiesel, so cars could use it, so that's what's incredible. And on one roof, it's obviously two birds, one stone. Basically, like cooking oil, use cooking oil, and biodiesel, so that was incredible. So, this is the back of it. Later, we'll go in this room out, check it out. This is like, like corrosive oils, or uh, just to clean, I think. There's loads of stuff running about. Let's check out that room out. Let's see what's there. That we can do that later. It's like it's slightly dark here, but that's a bee. Yeah, this bee is. Yep, playing with me. So let's check this out. To use the torch just in case. So I think it was a water cooling generator. Yeah, this was I think another line of oils or soap, I think. There are lots of. Oh, that's plastic. So cool. Don't have words to describe this. I think that's soil as well. An oil generator. Oh, where they do like oil as well. I think this was like a second part of it, apart from upstairs. Check. These are like fans. Let's go outside and check that room over there. Just lots of, lots of oil. Oh, yeah. Let's see. Don't know what. That is like, all right. And here we have like uh, stickers for the oils and lots of parts. Like nine to one from nine uh, papers from nine to one as well. So nineties. All right. It's like this, this part was, I think. Yeah, maintenance room as well. This particular room. Let's check out this room out. Goggles. Nice. This is as well part of the maintenance as well. Too much stuff like obviously like football stuff as well. Pipes. Oh like what's this. Like soda water. 
All right. Trying to find out if they have like stuff from that day as well, but there's nothing much going on in this room. I'm going to check out the other one. It's still like it's rather tall as well. And we're going to I don't think they do it anymore these. So obviously it's held that safety wise as well. And let's oh, I think this machine was either torn to pieces or you know disassembled. It was like here in the middle. It looks like a lift. Oh, let's check here before we go outside. Yes, it's assembled as well. I think this was like a rear generator because it looks massive or they transferred like water or oil or some kind of liquids as well in it which is cool as well and yeah oil we'll check out that room we're going in as well Let's see what this has there's too much stuff from about right, what's in here something I think yeah like electricity main switch here so yeah part of the building in the factory as well so I'm not incorrect Let's go outside that side just to check what's here I think there's it's from here. He was doyle here. Go then later. Let's check out these two rooms. all right look how massive this place is I'm still impressed by how big this place is as well well these are like storage rooms I think I'm seeing I'm seeing as well yeah this and loads and loads of olive oil cans as well at some point I think this was a uh, storage for oil. No, no. It's cool.